I just want to show you a short video of my Yamaha YP-D6 turntable. Uh, fully serviced, really nice condition. I'm going to show it to you in operation. Uh, we clean all the adjustments on the inside. All your uh, speed adjustments get clean. We're also going to give you a copy of the manual, so you're going to receive that, which is nice. Uh, pretty decent. Show you how to operate it. I'm gonna set that to the side. We're also gonna throw in a uh, Bob Seeger, real nice LP. May need light cleaning, but you're gonna get a nice LP too with it. Um, it does have a Staten model number L720 cartridge and stylus, so you're gonna receive a real nice cartridge and stylus. That's a, a Staten stylus and a cartridge. Dust cover, real nice shape. It's got a little light marks here and there, but nothing major. Uh, the wood sides, and well, like I say, I like the videos because you can actually see everything here on it. Very nice. I love the feet on this Yamaha. It has all the adjustment. It has adjustable feet on the bottom of it, so you can actually uh, level it out really nice. Uh, I'm going to turn it on here just so you can see it. I'll show you the inside here so you can see it really nice we have a set at 1.5 grams I recommend getting either the new digital uh, stylus so you can uh, adjust your uh, stylus pressure and everything uh, the anti skate you can adjust that too they'll show you online or you can text me I can actually or email me I can tell you how to do that uh, really nice I'm going to put the LP on. Let me put my uh, famous Chicago one on there. I'm going to start this guy here so you can see everything. And we do set everything and what you want to see when you run the speed. You see all that sitting still there. That's what you want to see. That's on 33 and I'm going to switch it to 44 and you'll see that bottom line too is sitting still. You'll see that sitting still too on it. So, and that's real nice when they operate properly. And you can adjust that, and it was a little out, but you can see that bottom line holding right in there. So, I'm going to switch it back to 33, which is the second line up at 60 megahertz. And you can see that, and I'm going to go in on it so you can see that stroll black and right in on that. And that's what you want to see. You want to make sure all your adjustments work properly here. It has a real nice uh, stylus and everything on it. This is a semi-automatic turntable, so what you're going to do is bring your left in. You're going to bring your uh, tone arm out. You want to make sure your left is out. We're going to go in. We're going to play the second song. Actually, we're going to go on to the lead song. I'm going to make sure I turn it down before I drop it. Easy here. And you can see it here. Nice and easy. Now I'm going to turn it here. Very nice sounding cartridge and style. Stanton does make a real nice one. Um, really nice condition. I'm going to hold the camera up here a little bit. I got it pretty high on this branch. Very nice operating. Very nice looking turntable. Bring the dust cover down as we're playing it here for a second. Very nice operation. So you're going to receive a copy of the manual, uh, Bob Seeger, the distance, LP, um, staying cartridge and stylus, and we do pack these very well. Uh, this is a semi-automatic, so what it, what, what, what it does here is when it gets to the end of the record, and I'm going to show it to you, what it'll do is come back over and go to your armrest and shut off automatically. A really nice operating unit. I'm going to start it up here again. I'm going to bring it up to your up point. Bring it down nice and smooth here. See that? 
very nice operating. I'm going to show you this side so you can see the sides of it. Any questions, please email. Thanks for watching my video.